这个。Hey guys, what's up? This is Lord of War 35, and today we are back on the Vega Conflict. Let's play.、Um, now, some of you guys may have noticed that there seems to be a lot fewer episodes than there was before, and you're correct. YouTube has decided to delete at least. 10 to 15 of my Vega Conflict videos for no apparent reason. All it says in the description of why it's deleted it says insufficient metadata or sometimes、um, misleading information or something.、Um, so YouTube deleted them and I unfortunately don't have the files to upload, upload them. So I just cut those out. I redid the thumbnails and we're on episode 11. So it is what it is, guys. So I just want to run you by some of the things I've been doing in my base because I've been playing this game non stop since, since I got back on it. And I'm finally at a point where I want to, you know, kind of show you guys what I'm doing and what I'm planning on doing in the future.、Uh, so we're going to go ahead and go to my profile and we're going to see what we're working on right now.、Um, the Shit Factory is currently not doing anything, and that's. Kind of、um, interesting because it's been working non stop the whole time. We're, we're just now taking a break with it.、Um, Alright, l the workshop isn't doing anything. The arms lab is currently upgrading.、Uh, it's got a day and seven hours. It's 363 coins in it, so it'll probably be done by earlier tomorrow.、Um, we're researching the Midgard Carrier Mark II. We're not equipping anything, we're not repairing anything. Alright. l Uh, so that's, that's basically、um, what's been happening. There's some drama going on in the chat right now. It's pretty sweet. I, think, I guess the biggest thing, the biggest change for me getting back out of Vega Conflict is destroying level 35 fleets.、Um, because if we just go ahead and look in here, all of these fleets, all seven of them, I had enough. Here, let me, let me go to an open fleet here. I have enough Rancor battleships to fill up all seven fleets to make level 35 auto fleets, right? And now they don't work.、Um, so that's, that's kind of disappointing. So I had to、um, get new ideas basically for the auto fleets, and it's the biggest adjustment is trying to get those up and running again. And I finally have a functional fleet thanks to、uh, Manny. I, you guys have probably seen him. You watch Vega Conflict videos. You've seen, seen a video of his or two.、Uh, so, we're going to go ahead and try to find a level 35 cargo, and I'm going to show you how this works. So, anyways, we'll be back once we get into this battle. Alright, so we're back. We found our target. We're closing in. We're about 10, ETA 10, 10 seconds. We're moving in. Almost there. Ready to go. The aptly named Rancor Cargo. It's not cargo, but it's Rancor. I don't know what that was. Alright, so the strategy here is just do this, this little maneuver. And, you know, make sure you don't have AI on because your ships just behave extremely stupid. So, while we're waiting for the Rancor Battleship 35 somewhat auto fleet to return to the base, we, I'm going to show you what I've been working on. And that's a Broadsword Destroyer、um, fleet. It's got crappy thermal beams on it, level 2. I don't have the level 3 ones, so unfortunately,、um, this thing isn't going to be super good until I get those. Also, I only have level 2 focused optics, so we're kind of running on low tech. Now, this thing almost takes out a 35, but it just doesn't have the firepower or the range.、Um, so, unfortunately, this、uh, entire fleet that I made is next to useless <laughs> until the point that I can upgrade it. I mean, they are all 
auto fleets or instant repair ships um but they're not they're just not that useful like i'll show you i'll show you them in action i guess we'll see if we can take out a rebel raiders level 20 i hope we'd be able to do that see we got about 40 seconds until that fleet comes in so we can show off a good little bit of combat here <sighs> we should be able to take this out i mean if we don't if we don't i think we should just give up on vague conflict like i'm saying it right now if we don't win this fight we, no <laughs> i'm not i don't trust this fleet oh wait wait no we're looking good we're looking pretty good here. Didn't even lose a ship. That is some professional grade combat right there. 285 loot. We are just rolling in it. We'll have this riot done in no time. Somebody do the math on that. How many of those would I need to take out? Um, average the time there that it took to destroy that one. And let me know. Alright, anyways, yeah, they're all Rancors are free. Instant repair. And did we make it in time for a spawn? Yes, we did. Let's see if we can get a good fleet here. Come on, something good. Something good. Level 35. Where are you at, 35? Where are you at? Found you. Don't you do it. Yow, you dirty dog. Are you for... Are you... Yow? What? What are you doing? Yow? What are you doing? Melody? Okay, what is happening here? The amount of damage that that did is... Oh, wow, okay. This dude's onto something. This, yeah, you're a genius. Why did I not think of this before? It was all, it was all so clear. <laughs> you have, you have brought me onto the right path, Yao. You have enlightened me in the ways of Vega conflict. I don't need thermal beams or any trash like that. All I needed was Gladys driver. Alright, we're just <laughs> we're just gonna randomly message this guy. Um Thank you. No explanation. <laughs> I'm just gonna do that. No explanation at all. We're just gonna go for it. All right. Anyways, let's find another let's find another cargo. All right, uh, we'll come back once we get to it. Oh, we found it. We found a Vega cargo level thirty five. It's it's taken years. Um, Yao has actually stolen the last uh, 15, 15, 15 cargos. Oh, we're we're just gonna throw our fleet at it and see how it goes. I've never done this before, so you know what whatever it's a let's play gotta find something stupid to do let's go fleet all right looks we're looking good we got the old uh four two split that we like to see on a rank or cargo uh fleet attack it looks like they're all aiming down that first cruiser there it's a nice one more hit it gets it we didn't even waste the gladius driver bullet and straight onto the second cruiser all right you got one ship down uh, another ship taking some heavy fire uh we got Ooh, second ship goes down, but the cruiser is down, and the Dread Battleship is taking hits. It's taking hits. We could do it. We could pull off the Miracle Victory. The battleship, two battleships down, and we're, we're ganging up on the Trident Destroyer. We got it, guys. We've got the clutch. We've got the level. We've got the level 25, 35 auto fleet in the bag. The Vancor ships do it. We, we don't even need Yao. We, di we didn't even need him. We didn't even need him to steal our ship. Give him a piece of my mind. 
All right. All right, there we go, guys. There it is, the new, the new auto fleet. And it's the way to go. You don't need to do anything. You just throw the ships at it and hope it works. I'm going to need to do some more testing on that, but um, we'll just call it good for now. <laughs> we'll just we'll just say it works 100% of the time. It it has worked 100% of the time that I've done it. So that means it works 100% of the time. Well, um some plans for the future. What am I going to be doing in the next episodes? I don't know. Yeah. Whatever. <laughs> we'll we'll find out. Anyways, guys, thank you for watching this video. Make sure to leave a like down below if you like and subscribe for more Vega Conflict content in the future. That's about it for me, and I will see you in the next video. Just kidding, guys. We're back. I, I, I couldn't end the video without showing you the ship fitting, so we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna see what is on the Rancor battleships now. Um. We got a explosive shield, level two shockwave shield. Um, that's basically this and this combined for a low repair time. It's under five minutes, so it's free instant repair. Over here, we got the straight thrusters. Um, now, rear thrusters level four. I did some quick testing because honestly, I have ships with rotation three thrusters that I used in my old auto fleet, and those work just fine. So. The thrusters probably aren't important. Um, I've tested it with rotation three and with uh, stray four. Uh, so, you know, whichever you feel more comfortable with putting on, I'm sure rotation three works. Well, rotation three does work just as well and it's less build time. Anyways, we got an Iridium Magnets three on it, a Plasteel one and four level one Gladius drivers for a whopping 72 DPS, 127 health, and 158 shield. Uh, rocking at a 280 meters per second speed at a turning of 6.4 degrees a second and a strafe of 140 meters per second. So there you go, guys. Uh, cargo capacity of 66,000 with an expected fleet level of level 32. Modifiers range. Okay, so that is the fleet. It's just six of those. They're instant repair. Just throw them at the level 35s. So anyways, guys, uh, this is going to be the end of the video. The real end. So blah, 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 blah. Leave a like. Blah, 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 blah. Subscribe and blah, blah, blah. Next video. Peace.